Hi guys and welcome back to another teardown video. This week we're taking a look at TMR switches. TMR stands for Tunnel Magneto Resistance and similar to the inductive switches I covered a few weeks ago, it's a contactless electromagnetic switching technology like the Hall Effect but its operating principle is completely different from HE and so it functions like a modern alternative to it. If you're unfamiliar with Hall Effect switches, I covered them in detail in a previous teardown video, click the link in the description to go to that. Tunnel magneto resistance is conducted in a so-called magnetic tunneling junction, or MTJ, which consists of a sandwich of two ferromagnets separated by a thin insulating layer, typically composed of magnesium oxide. If this layer is thin enough, a quantum mechanical phenomenon called quantum tunneling can occur, which is where a particle moves through a potential energy barrier that it doesn't have enough energy to overcome. Basically, it's the universe activating the no-clip cheat code, not dissimilar to a person walking through a wall. In these MTJ layers, the tunneling from one ferromagnet to the other is relatively easy if the magnetizations of the two layers are parallel, while this reduces drastically if they oppose each other. In order to achieve this for a push-button switch, one of the layers has to have low coercivity, meaning that its magnetization can be easily rotated by an external magnetic force, namely the magnet in the slider. This is called the free layer. The other one is called the reference layer, and its magnetization is kept constant by so-called pinning, which is usually done by coupling it to an anti-ferromagnet, usually a manganese alloy of some kind. Because of this pinning, this layer doesn't respond to the influence of the external magnet in the slider. As the slider is pressed down, the rotation of the free layer changes, usually from parallel to anti-parallel, and with it, the tunneling probability, which is measurable as a change in resistance. As with HE, this effect proceeds in an analog fashion, and as such, the keyboard can determine how far down the switch has been pressed. TMR is an alternative to HE with superior performance, as the whole effect needs relatively strong magnetic fields to produce the tiny hole voltages, while tunnel magneto resistance can be measured even at very weak fields, which results in greater accuracy and resolution. The very low currents it uses also decrease power consumption compared to whole effect switches. As with many contactless switches, the complicated stuff is all held PCB side, so the switch itself is very simple, consisting of just five parts. Two parts housing, the slider, the magnet, and the coil spring, exactly like a Hall Effect switch, though the two aren't generally interchangeable. These ones also come with an external light pipe that isn't an integral part of the switch, nor does it require it to function. That's it for this video, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.